What's up everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Croc, Legend of the Gobos. If you remember last time we defeated uh, Platform Pete, well we didn't really defeat, we beat the level, but uh, still, still, uh, we're, we're, we beat the last level and now we're ready to beat the, the guy who started this all, uh, Baron Dante. So, about to play World 4, level, boss level 2, Baron Dante's Funky Inferno. This would be a perfect time for like some disco music or something. Just imagine like staying alive playing right now. Oh, that guy is pissed. He's very confident though. He's got one blue one blue hand and like one regular green hand. It's like Luke Skywalker or Anakin Skywalker, I guess, I don't know. I think both of them had arms chopped off. But uh we're ready. We're pumped. We're gonna get some gushers, and we're gonna we're gonna prepare for this the final battle. Well, there we go. This area is pretty. Should be pretty easy as long as you keep moving. Oops! Almost jumped right into that. Can't get me. Let's do this. Baron Dante, I'm coming for you. Coming to get you. I'm gonna rescue King Gobo. Oh, look at the lighting effects. Oh, he already hurt himself. Oh, look at that MLG. I think that was the equivalent of like a no set. Oh shoot. Oh no, that was the equivalent of a fail right there. What did he just laugh for? I didn't he didn't hit me. Nor did I think I hit him. Charge. Yeah, we beat him! Hooray, game over. But oh, wait, there's more. You gonna do something? Oh, there he goes. So yeah, he just charges like a charger in Left 4 Dead 2, except he's even less accurate. He like misses you by a mile and you'll... Oh shoot, that wasn't good. Oh! I didn't even see him. Camera movement. Alright, one more hit should do it. Yeah! But wait! There's even more. And he flies now. So I'm gonna adopt the uh, Crash Bandicoot boss strategy and just run around in a big circle. Or that could happen. Probably waited too long. So yeah, you just really wait for him to fall and then do your little circle strafe. Because he doesn't know how to lead his shots, wait for him to go on the ground. That's hit too, man. One more hit and you're done. You better step it up. Nope. Don't you land. You're dead. Ah, I lost my gushers. Oh well. 41 lives, we're doing alright. So yeah, game over. Like, he's not even like weak, he's just like, oh yeah, if I get hit nine times, I, I die. I don't die, I just get teleported somewhere else. Oh look, but where's the key? What the heck, Croc? Could he... You could have did that all along. Why did why did we need to go searching for all these keys if you could have just broken down everything? That would have saved me a lot of time. So yeah. K 
King Gobo erecting a nice statue of Croc. That's kind of creepy. Isn't that like? Isn't that like bad? Not bad. What's what's the word I'm looking for? Isn't that like? Uh, not good to be like dancing on someone's like messing with their statue if someone had like a statue dedicated to them isn't that like disrespectful I don't know so yeah that's the game now we got the credits which I really don't want to see can we skip these I'm not sure I might have to edit these out People named Eric with uh, different spelling. That's great. Mike Schneider. I knew a Mike Schneider. Argonaut Software. Some pretty good level designers, though. I mean, this game was pretty. It's pretty nice. I mean, it, it, it very. I like the artwork. I like the levels were, were challenging. I mean, they're sort of puzzly. Some of them were just like stupid, like the cauldron ones. I mean, those made no sense. It's just. I don't know. Voice talent. Yeah, they only needed like one guy because nobody even said any like anything. Uh, any words, they were all just like utters. Character design. Character animation. Not that many people worked on this game, I don't think. It seems like it was a very small studio. Of course, then again, I've never heard of the studio. I think they only made. They might have made this game, and I don't know if they made Croc 2 or not, but. Special thanks. Carl Graham. Graham. Now look for the secret jigsaw pieces. But wait! There's more. Four. Level 4 S2 Jailhouse Croc. So, uh. I guess we're gonna go ahead and do this. I, have, I actually didn't do a playthrough of this, so we're gonna see. Uh. I'm not really sure what I need to do this level. I don't think... Ah, I missed a gusher. No gusher gets left behind, people. Luscious fruit gushers are, are the only way you can do stuff. I don't know. Jeez. Hopefully this level's not too bad. I really don't hope on... Ah, uh, of course. I know exactly what kind of platform this is going to be. It's going to shrink. Yeah. Well, this should be the puzzle. The puzzle he should be in this next area, I hope. Maybe. Oh god, look at this. This is like something out of Indiana Jones, I'd imagine. Oh no, I missed one! No! Did they respawn? Oh, they do. I'm ah, uh, screw it. Forget about it. I'm probably over time anyways, I'm probably going to have to split this up into two, two, two parts. Donde esta? Puzzle piece. I don't know, I'm not very good at Spanish. Well, 66 gushers, we're moving up. Oh, no, 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 why did I stop? Right when I said that too, I just jinxed myself. It's like, oh, we're doing great! 70 gushers! Nothing can go wrong! It's not a care in the world! Bam! Trident, guys. Those people can actually snipe you in this game. 
But it's okay, we didn't lose a life. We... We didn't even lose a life in the boss battle, heck. But wait, there's even more! So we got all the puzzle pieces, and now Croc's gonna be like, Oh yeah, so I just collected these puzzle pieces for no reason. Let's see what they do. What is this? Uh oh. A fifth island! So yeah, people, uh... The series is not quite over yet. It's, uh, got a few more levels to go. Um, and we're gonna do that next time, so... Oh man, Baron Dante is back. It's like Frieza in uh, in in Dragon Ball Z when he comes back as the robot guy. So yeah, we're gonna do this next time. I'm gonna wrap this up real quick before I go over, over in time. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you next time.